Hello everybody, to scan a QR code using PHP, we will need a library to download. So go to Google and type PHP QR code reader. Find the GitHub link and go ahead and download the library. By the way, you can find links in description. So after downloading the package, you will find a library folder. Just paste that in your working directory. Then we have uploads folder we have where we have a couple of QR codes for testing. And this is the file which we will be using to code our QR code reader. So firstly go ahead and require the library. The location is lab slash QR reader.php. So we will be scanning all the QR codes in our uploads folder. So first of all let's scan the folder store the value in a variable called files then let's check if it's returning the proper array yes so we are getting if you are in one to then you may have to assign uh, permissions to read it publicly so let's look through our array to get uh, each file name so by this uh, code will be removing all the legal files names and will be just getting whatever we require for our working so for testing let's print out all the file names in our uploads folder so let's test it out so yes we do get the file names so let's use this file name and uh, collect the data in it so they're actually decoding the data in QR code so let's uh, first instantiate the QR uh, code class so we are in we are creating object called QR code and we'll be passing in a value that is the path of the file. So we know that it's in uploads folder and the name of file is the value stored in variable file. So we'll be concatenating that. So next uh, we have to retrieve the value that is present in QR code so we'll use a function called test uh, text sorry and we will be storing it in another variable called text so we'll be just echoing out this value and uh, it should probably work so there we get an error so let's see what's the problem okay so we just have to include the slash so let's test it again yes it works these are the exact values that were coded inside these QR codes so that's pretty much it for this video if you like the video go hit that subscribe button and I'll see you in the next video